I was blindsided and I'm still shocked and saddened by Bell Media's decision. It's been less than two weeks since CTV News anchor Lisa Laflamme shared a video on Twitter saying she'd been let go. And since then, brands like Wendy's Canada have used the situation for marketing. On August 25th, Wendy's Canada changed their Twitter profile picture from the iconic red-haired girl in pigtails to a gray-haired, blue-toned girl saying, because a star is a star regardless of hair color. Hashtag Lisa Laflamme. But was this a good piece? our move from the brand? It's um, risky and from my standpoint, I wouldn't have taken that risk. A president of a marketing agency in Edmonton says Wendy's chose a very polarizing topic to market themselves through and that could hurt their brand. Yes, I think you do need to make a stance at times, but you have to truly evaluate, you know, your audience and whether you're going to offend your target audience and your followers. On Twitter, the reactions have been mixed, with one Canadian saying, awesome, today is a good day to treat the entire office to Frosties. While another Twitter user responded with, well, you have lost a customer. You are a food chain. Keep your politics to yourself. I don't know how a head office ever approved this. Wendy's tweeted back, this has nothing to do with politics, with a sassy gif attached saying, okay, bye. In this case, I think Wendy's has has been able to start the conversation and stand on behalf of you know, making sure that non-discriminatory behavior continues at a corporate level. Another company that released a campaign recently is Dove Canada, with this tweet about hashtag keep the gray, saying, age is beautiful. Women should be able to do it on their own terms without any consequences. In response to being asked if their campaign was strategically released after La Flamme's news, Dove replied, the campaign was launched in response to the widespread national conversation about gray hair and ageism in the workplace and that it was not intended to be directed to any one situation or organization. The PR consult founder says even if it wasn't their intention, the timing is very on brand. What I have seen from Dove in the past, they have very inclusive campaigns. They talk about body positivity in different countries. They talk about um, activities around, you know, going gray and embracing the silver, which for them, it's very on brand. For Wendy's, not quite as on brand, but an opportunity to be part of the discussion. City News reached out to Wendy's Canada for their response, but they did not reply in time for a broadcast deadline. For other brands looking to market smart in the future, the marketing agency president shares his advice. Cleverness is something that um, is like creativity. Um, it's, it's difficult to um, acquire. Um, but when, you, when it's done right, um, you can create that following that, that you need or create that result that you're trying to achieve. In Edmonton, Sarah Chu, City News.